I'm 61 years old. I, I know I might look younger, but uh, I've been self-employed since I was 29. I'm a, uh, an accountant and a lawyer by education. Uh, I went to work starting my own law firm when I was, I swore I'd be working for myself by the time I was 30, and I barely made it. Uh, what that has allowed me to do, uh, being self-employed, is I don't answer to anyone, so I have been able to do things that I thought were important that were outside of my law practice, uh, because without regard to an employer or a supervisor or something like that. I've been on a uh, faith journey for decades now, and one of my passions is faith-based ministries uh, in both the uh, white and the African American community. Uh, and using my legal background and my business background and my just affection for everybody, I live in a world that that I care for everyone regardless of what zip code they're, they may be from. I've had the privilege of working with different sorts of ministries, be it churches or nonprofits, to do complicated things, start new uh, nonprofits, start new churches, to more minor things as setting up uh, bylaws or for uh, some new entity. My passion is that. I, I, I don't have a big tool set. I can read and write pretty well, and I'm a good lawyer, and I have an accounting background, uh, and I love working with people that may be very different than me. And so I have worked with, for 25 years, with evangelical ministers. I'm an Episcopalian. Maybe I'm an evangelical Episcopalian, but I've worked with uh, ministers of all different backgrounds, uh, persons that are doing nonprofit work for different entities around town that the chamber knows a lot about, <clears throat> and it's allowed me to to help others. I've also uh, and have a, have an impact uh, and be a part of what I think is important in my faith journey. Also, because of a family member who is uh, mentally challenged, I have been involved in uh, doing whatever I can with respect to helping mentally challenged students or young people, adults. And over the years, I have worked with handicapped students, particularly with respect to issues of disabilities and uh, getting access to public schools and that sort of thing, and have greatly enjoyed providing that for them.